Hello guys, what's going on? This is Paul here, back for another video. Today looking at this war of mine, and I initially decided to pick this up after watching uh, Total Biscuits video on it. And I seen some of the other YouTubers I was subscribed to pick it up. Uh, I had a brief look at it and decided, yeah, I'll just pick it up and see what's up, because coming up to Christmas time, there really isn't that much to play right now for me. Um... I guess the only other game I'm interested in is The Crew, but any other releases that I want have already been released. So, uh, I'm looking for some more games to fill the time. And, uh, this one seemed to be getting pretty good praise online, so I, I figured why not. It's a sort of survival game, um, from what I, what I can see. Uh, other than that, I'm going in here with completely <laughs> zero experience. So... Maybe I'll count on you guys to help me a little bit throughout this, but since we are in some sort of abandoned complex right now, it says fuck the war there on the walls. It seems war has torn all of these people apart. So, let's see. We have three people. When the Civil War broke out, many people thought it would last a few weeks. Uh... Katia, I think. That's her. And then we have Bruno and Pavel. Uh, very nice. So, we have to scavenge for things. We have to get things. And we have to uh, basically just survive. So, I'm gonna... Oh, no, no, no. I want you to... Uh, you can scavenge that. Uh, Bruno, you're the cook. You're the fast runner. And you are slightly sick. We need to find some uh, medicine for her. So we have some herbs. Uh, that may just help. Uh, wood. Clean water, sugar, and components. I'm going to grab all of those. And exit from there. You're sick. So I assume working may just aggravate your condition. Is there some sort of couch? Or some sort of bed that you can sleep in? While uh, we get stuff done here. You can go upstairs and clean that out, Bruno. Um, a few improvements and it can't be livable. Well, you're a fast runner. You need something to open the lock. I believe this is a crafting table here. You can actually, uh, you know, make things. So we have a bed. Uh, it'll take an hour to make. I'm going to make that. And if we make that, let's see, we'll put that there. Oh, wait. Where's our bed? Put that there. Um, I'm not sure if that's actually way back there or not. But I'm going to get him to make it. And I want her to actually go on uh, on Katia, I think that's her name. To, uh, you know, lay down in the bed after that. She is sick and I don't want to aggravate her condition anymore. It is 9 a.m. So we're doing pretty well. Right now, I still give him the scavenge up there. What do we got here? Hmm. So the bed is made now. I want to get you. Come down there. And I would like you to head down here. Now she's sick, so making her sleep should help her, right? Is what I'm thinking here. He's still scavenging up there, but... We can open this door. We can kick it down, right? Yeah, there we go. So let's go in here and have a little look at this. How's Bruno doing up there? He seems to be finished now, and we've managed to get some more herbs, parts, sugar, clean water. So I'll take all of those. And I would like uh, Bruno to go over and search that. How are you doing? She's recovering now. Nice. Um, Bruno managed to find some raw food. So, again, Bruno is the cook. It's pretty good. I'm going to go back up to him here, actually. Uh, what's that? What's that? Is that, like, lockpick? Yep. Seems quite safe. Yeah, I think we might need to move the bed eventually. Down there. I'm not really sure what the... The 
ideal sort of <laughs> thing is here, but we'll do that. And there's loads of stuff down here, actually. Are you recovered yet? How about you? You're both... Have you had some kind of shovel? So there must be... You know what, Bruno? You actually go down here. And we'll make some stuff. Because I'm thinking there must be a better way to dig up all of this, right? Surely there must be. So down he goes. And um, we'll let him just scavenge there while Bruno comes down. How you doing there? You doing okay? Recovering still. Okay, let's bring up the crafting desk. Or workshop, I guess. Or radio. Um, moonshine. Filter. I'm really sure they do, but I guess it's better than nothing. Uh, I'll make one of those. Can we put it down? Improvement. Uh, improve workshop to make more things then. And then some rainwater filters. We'll get, make some of those. We put those outside. All right, let's uh, see what we got here. Decent. We could use more. We don't have a radio. We miss books. We lack coffee and cigarettes. We have breaches in the wall. And we'll have to constantly be on guard. So we're going to come down here and... There's a bunch of stuff there. Let's scavenge. You're still recovering. What's that door? What's inside there? It's locked. Not good. Well, if you can go over and scavenge there. It's slowly becoming night, so... Coffee drinker. <laughs> Don't drink coffee, kids. It's too late for me. Um, so you can't even do anything, can you? So how about you go up there and search? It is getting quite late, guys. So we may need to move this. Can we move the bed? I don't think we can. She's still slightly sick. Can you get in there? Give me all of those. See if there's anything we can do down here. It's night time, oh no! Okay, plan the night. I want you to sleep in bed, and I would like you to guard. We're currently at the shelter college. We can move if we want. Lots of meds, food. I want to stay here. Day two, guys. I'm only going to be doing like 20, 30 minute parts. The night was calm. Okay, so we did pretty well there. Is she is that poorly and hungry? But she's just hungry now, so we got some food up here. You can go up and eat that. And you can sleep. Okay. You go up there and search for that. You go and scavenge for that. Now we've got three of them on the case. This should be good. Wish you had some coffee. What can you do then? Medikits in here. Is there anything you really can do here? What's outside there?
I'm not sure if she's gonna hurt herself if she goes outside here, so... I'm eager to see what happens here. What does she do? Okay, nothing, I guess. Close the door. Did you find anything? No. Clear that out. Uh, is there anything else we can do here, guys? Maybe. Still scavenging. For food. And water. Huh? Anything we can make? <laughs> nope. Nope. Still can't get through there. Still can't get through there. Oh, if you do it twice, it does it twice as fast. Nice, some herbs. Bruno wants to sleep. I don't think there's time for sleeping here, Bruno. Eh, some decent stuff. Nice, nice. And we'll come over here. I don't want you to sleep, but I would like you to... No, get up, get up, get up. Bruno, sleep. Need something to open it. We got another bed. Because I think that's all we can really do here. We can actually make two beds. Wow. Sleeping on the floor is terrible, but you're not going to sleep on the floor, buddy. Is it wise to leave him up there by himself? I don't know. There's still no food. We need more wood. Do we not already have one of those? Make one of those then. So we can get some food on the go. Oh, I got enough. Is there anything we can do with these? It says drag for more. There really isn't anything else. Well, you're still hungry, but you can guard, right? And... I think we're going to end our day there, guys. What's that do? Oh, I was touching that walk. Okay. Okay, I'm just going to end the day now and then. I don't think there's anything else for us to do. Or I'm completely missing it. Sleep in bed. Sleep in bed. And you can guard. And I want to go there.
We need to go and scavenge. Hmm. I think we should go to the shelter cottage. We only send one out to scavenge. There's gotta be Pavel, he's a fast runner. Let's just go. Let's go. I didn't even know what to do at this point, but I'm willing to take a risk on it. Let's see. This house is still burning. Is it safe to go inside? Use fists to combat. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Is there anyone there? Nice materials and wood here. Um, peek in, give it a peek. I don't see anyone. Let's go in then. Quickly scavenge for food. Some potatoes, potatoes. Sugar. Um, definitely want as much meat as I can get here. And all of that water. Sugar. I don't see anyone moving right now, so I'm assuming I should be okay. Take some of them herbs. Snake. This is spooky. I don't see anyone just yet. Let's quickly rush over here and peek. If we do see someone, we're screwed. Anyone? Looks like we're safe. For no, I, at least I think we're safe. Right, what do we got here? We got components. The wood's more important. Crap. He's a fast runner, he is, but... Is anyone down here? I don't see anyone. More wood. Do it quickly. Gosh, this is taking forever. Yeah, it's probably not worth doing that. Oh gosh, I feel like I'm about to be attacked at this point. It's just a rat. Is that another house? I need a shovel, man. Honestly, I don't think I'm gonna get far. And I'm already full. Let's just run. He's a fast runner after all, isn't he? I think that was a pretty successful uh, evening, don't you though? We got some pretty good stuff. Scavenged pretty well. Day three, guys. Seems we weren't robbed either, which is always good, right? Oh, crap. Someone tried to rob us. They didn't do much. We had... Too bad we had no weapons. They were wounded. Ah, oh, she's wounded. Crap. Not good, guys. 
quickly go over here. Can we make anything now? Oh my, did I make another bed? I really shouldn't have done that. I really should have made, uh... I used a lot of wood on. I need more components though. Well, that's my fault. Anyway, guys, I am uh, going to sign out here. Let me know if you have any tips. And uh, I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.